there are two different models of analytical balance in the laboratory. Each balance measures the weights of substances or any object below 200 grams and gives accurate reading up to four decimal places. Press this button to switch on or switch off the analytical balance. The tear button is used to reset the reading to exactly 0 grams. Open the window to place the substance or object to be weighed on the plate. Close it back and wait for the reading to stabilize. If you are left-handed, you can use the window on the left hand side. The spirit level is used to ensure that the analytical balance is perfectly leveled so that it gives accurate reading. Depending on the model, the spirit level may be located at the back or at the front left of the analytical balance. The air bubble is not at the center, means the balance is not leveled yet. The position of the air bubble is adjusted by rotating the screw on either side of the balance. Now the balance is perfectly leveled and ready to use. Let's say Approximately 0.15 grams of sodium chloride is needed for an experiment, but the accurate mass of sodium chloride is required for calculation. How to measure the accurate mass of the sample? Switch on the power supply. Switch on the analytical balance. A weighing bottle is used to contain sodium chloride. This is the mass of the weighing bottle in grams. Whether the mass needs to be recorded or not depends on the requirement of the experiment. Before adding sodium chloride into the weighing bottle, press the tear button to reset the reading. Be careful not to drop sodium chloride on the plate outside the weighing bottle. Any number that can be rounded off to 0 0.15 is approximately 0 0.15 grams. But the accurate mass measured by this balance should be recorded. The screen now shows the mass of sodium chloride. What if an object is weighed by two different analytical balances?
the mass of the weighing bottle measured by two different balances are slightly different because each balance has its own systematic error. Systematic error is caused by a miscalibrated instrument that affects all measurements. So try to use the same balance when measuring any mass for an experiment to avoid systematic error. Sometimes, substances spill on the plate during weighing. Clean the balance using a brush. Use a clean weighing bottle to weigh the substance. 